Hey guys, I'm just coming here to film this really quickly for YouTube. Um, I was debating all week on what I wanted to post about this week about Jesus. And um, as I was getting ready for my workout, I'm in my workout gear right now, um, something came to me and it was Jesus basically saying that you don't have to get all pretty to talk about Jesus. You don't have to get all pretty for Jesus. I mean, it is nice to do so sometimes, of course, but you don't have to always try to please God. You know, I mean, in that sense is you don't always have to try to look so good for God. Like God already knows our flaws. He knows like our circumstances. And so what I'm trying to say is that like, you don't always have to get dressed up for God. Sometimes you can just meet him where you are, or he wants you to meet you where you are, you know? Um, you don't have to put on, like, a facade or or get all fancy for Jesus. Um, and sometimes it is okay to do that. You can get dressed up and, and go all out for the Lord, um, both spiritually and physically. But sometimes it's also good to just meet the Lord where you are in your mess and in your disgust and in your ugly ways and just turn to God and ask for help um, because he sees us in all of our forms and he loves us anyway he sees us when we're not looking so hot when we're you know at our you know not looking at our best weight when we're not when our hair is not done you know when we're not looking our best so we don't have to try to impress God we just have to try to do the best that we can do for Jesus. And also, I just want to reiterate that I didn't mean that we shouldn't, um, like, seek God or anything. That we should seek God with everything in us. But we shouldn't have to try to put on a facade or um, fake a smile for Jesus. Like, he sees our emotions. He sees our thoughts anyway like he knows what we're thinking right before we're gonna think it anyway so this is just like a little video that i'm making just to encourage you and and just to show you that you know um i had all these ideas planned out for a youtube video this week and i didn't get to make them and that's okay and i'm making this video now but the message of this video is just basically that it's okay to not be okay. It's okay to come to Jesus with all your flaws and your insecurities and to really lay them out for him. It's okay to not know what to do. It's okay to not be perfect because we are imperfect. The only perfect one is Jesus. So, but that does not mean that we should, you know, excuse our willful sin. We shouldn't willfully sin at all um so that's just pretty much the message for this week and i had like everything planned out and excuse me um i had everything planned out and i uh was going to like i had all these topics to talk about for jesus and about jesus but um, it's actually funny that, you know, God is having me make this video like this. I'm holding my phone in my hand and I'm about to work out um, on a Zoom call with my best friend. So, um, yeah, I never expected to, like, make a video like this, but God works in mysterious ways. And uh, sometimes you just have to, you know, I mean, all the time we should follow God and we never know what God's going to do. He's he's always surprising us in beautiful ways. And so I just I just love that about him and um yeah, so the message is, you know, come to God with all your flaws, all your insecurities, all your ugly ways and he will fix you and you know and you don't always have to look your best for God. You don't always have to be your best for God, but we must try our best. We must try our best. And even if we fail, you know, God is still there, but we always should try to please God. But it is okay if you do fail sometimes because, you know, he expects it, you know, we're human. So 
um, yeah, just come to uh, God with all your insecurities and everything, and he will help you. Um, and I really hope that this encourages somebody uh, today, this week, uh, just know that God loves you and that he loves all your imperfections. He doesn't love your sin, but he loves all your imperfections. He just loves you and he wants you to come to him um, no matter how disgusting you think you are, how much, no matter how much you've sinned, Jesus still wants you to come to him. And that's what he's saying. And that's what the message is this week. So, all right, um, I look horrible, but you know, this is how God wanted me to do the video this week. So just be encouraged with that. And um, yeah, so I will talk to you guys another time and I hope that you guys have a great week. Bye.